Hello guys, now if you've watched my videos, you'll know that um, on Christmas Day, I got um, a surprise when I opened the door and found that somebody, and I've no idea who it was, and, have not, and nobody online has admitted to it, so I've no idea who it was, left me some biscuits and some clothes. I don't know why, but there you go. And um, some other things. So anyway, I did a complete video about it. Okay, on um, but anyway, I when I got these, originally on Christmas Day, they were out of date, but they weren't out of date enough for me, you see. You see, they were about, they were about a month out of date, but they, that's just not enough. You need them to be even more out of date than that, right? So, it claims that these are nice biscuits. Um, you know, I dread to think what horrible biscuits taste like. Um, you know, I uh, don't think anybody has ever marked any biscuits called horrible or taste dreadful or anything like that. But anyway, these are nice biscuits, okay? And the date on this is the 12th of November 22. That's the expiry date, um, or best of all date. It's currently the 22nd of March 2023. Yesterday, Boris Johnson attended um, some sort of dis potential disciplinary hearing where... He claims for the first time he did mislead Parliament, but he claimed he didn't know about it. He said that he was that he said what he believed was true in good faith, uh, but you couldn't have known that the actual um, hearing was yesterday, or that the um, would be yesterday, or that the information would be published yesterday um, on the 21st of March. That could not have been known several months ago. So there you go, guys. This is now roughly just over four months of, out of date now. So I'm going to open them. And then I'm going to try some. And I'm going to hope nobody's like tampered with them or anything. You know, I hope this isn't some sort of nasty poison pot or something. Mm. If it is, then so be it, okay? So I've just opened it. I'm going to take out one of these biscuits. Now, on the back, it claims they it says coconut biscuits. Um, that's what they claim. They don't look that coconutty to me, but they look like normal shortbread. But they claim coconut biscuits. I say it consists of 45 wheat flour, sugar, vegetable oils, desecrated coconut. Now, when I've had this credit coke in the past, I've used it uh, it in um, a sort of cake. No, cake's not really quite the right word, but it is. And I used to use it inside. Um, like a sponge cake. Um, it also says it's got soy flour, wheat, starch, raising agents, salt. And it says partially inverted refiner's syrup. What's partially inverted mean regarding this? I have no idea. How can you invert syrup and how can you partially in, um, refine syrup? I wouldn't know. It also claims it's got a flavouring as well. So there you go. Anyway, this is one of the biscuits. Yeah, it's got the words. Nice, actually. Pressed into it. Embedded embossed into it so I'm going to break it stuff it open just a normal this kid looks like a short cake biscuit I have had these before in the past um to be absolutely honest I know that I know that hills are cheap budget brands you usually get them at local shops They sometimes are cheaper as the supermarket because usually supermarkets are cheaper than local shops. Um, because the local shops sometimes some people might not walk in for 10 or 20 minutes and they've got to pay people to stand there doing not too much. So I'll have another one.
I don't know what's happened, but the camera's just stopped, so... If it's not filming this, I apologise. But you did see me anyway. I don't know what's happened, but the screen went blank, and now... It looks like it's stuck. I could stop the video and... I'm not going to, I'm just going to talk, so there you go, I've been perfect okay, although I think perhaps I may have lost a bit of sleep, I don't know if it's because they're a cheaper brand or sometimes it happens like this in um, Christmas collections, you know, well, you can buy these um, biscuit things at Christmas, you see, and sometimes they have things from this thing there, okay, but buy perhaps a different brand or a better brand, okay? So yeah, I have no idea why I'm going to be I can't see it updating on here. Okay, no, it's updating now. I don't know if it's um, a bit affected the recording or not, to be honest, but my, uh, my it's almost like I, I paused, almost like I've done a still, you know? That's how it looked to me, but the, the video's working again, so. So, not for like a pan, guys, it's still this one. That's for magic fans, okay? Now you see it. I don't know if I can do this. Now you don't. I know that's really terrible, but you can because you can see it there. But you know, but I don't have like the right proper sort of magicians like thing where they'd be really, really, you know, like this or something, you know. Like, It's really weird, it's really disappeared now. I've put one up there and it's really disappeared. <clears throat> oh, it's dropped out again, right. So they do things like this, you know. Abra Cadabra. No, it's not working. No, no, it's, it's difficult trying to work out when you... I now understand the problems these people have when they're dealing with the screens, because, you know, you can see so... It's really weird when it really does disappear for real, you know? I don't know what I'm doing this for. I'm going to all over the bed. Um. Right, yeah. Okay, so... Abracadabra. <laughs> Again, by cheating. Abra. This is really sucky, I know. Why 
always in a goddamn hard. You must need to have the right kind of like clothing for this. I'm beginning to appreciate that you need. Abracadabra. <laughs> yes, I know it's really terrible because, you know, my jumper's not up to the job. But what's really frustrating is they were starting to really disappear up here and down there. And how do they manage to do it for real? I don't know. Must be special magician's clothing or something. Anyway, guys. Um, there you go. Nice biscuits. And to whoever it was who gave me them, thank you. I've still no, I'm still none the wiser. But there you go. Now the cracker balls disappeared. Oh dear. I hope it won't happen because it's so annoying. And the problems I have is I've got a cracker ball and it keeps disappearing. Right, pound it. No, but it keeps falling out. It's designed to stay in, but every time it falls out, it's a trackball. Not a trackball, trackball. Okay, guys. Often, by the way, we used to use some of these in some arcade games in the past. So, people do not to be black and white. A lot of younger people might even know what the hell this is, never seen anything like it. There you go. It's basically an embroidered joystick, so it's like an upside down joystick, if you like. I'm kind of moving a joystick left and right, and you just will, okay? Anyway, guys, that's enough for today. Thanks for watching. Bye.